Hi friends, welcome back to the channel. Today's video is a simple speech on importance of water and its storage and conservation methods. Good morning all. Today I have been blessed with this opportunity to deliver my speech on importance of water and methods of its storage and conservation. Everyone knows that water is the soul of our life. Water is the most precious gift to the humanity by the nature. It is the most basic need for our survival, safety, progress and development. It is a scarce, natural and easy available resource. But do we care about the people use of water? And we are becoming reckless towards its use? Can we imagine our life without sufficient water? In fact, no one can live without water though we all acknowledge the fact yet we are misusing it mindless without caring most of the earth covered with water but why do we keep saying we have a water problem that because water is the ocean and seas are salty we cannot drink it we cannot use in water crops and factories Fresh water is a scarce resource in many parts of the world. Water storage is essential for our life. Early man need a fresh water too. Those early people have to store in the well. We still use some of them. Currently we use particular ideas like bore wells, build bonds across the river and lakes. And we built really big wall across the river called dams. We get useful water from rain. Rainwater is fresh water. Rainwater harvesting will play a big role in storage of water like rainwater storage tank, silplane water storage tank, etc. are some of the new methods prevailing today. You know, what is the conservation? The protection and careful use of water called conservation. We are depend on just a small of water. So, it's our responsibility that we must not pollute it. Water conservation is only way to solve the problem of water scarcity in the future. World Water Day is celebrated on March 22 in the whole world. Its main purpose is to make people aware of water conservation. We may conserve water by preventing water leakage in our taps hand pumps, water storage tank, etc. We should educate our children as well as community members about the importance of water conservation. At community level, various seminars and public gatherings should be organized to raise the issues of water saving. We have to follow the latest agriculture methods and technology to avoid heavy water needs. Now we can easily understand that water is a scarce and limited resource as well it is very necessary for our life. Therefore, we must use and utilize water is a very significant plan and conservation manner. So friends, please give a call to your conscience and start applying the water conservation methodology in our day-to-day -day life. Also think that the future generation. I'm concluding my words. Thank you. Have a wonderful day.